Today's poem is titled Common Cold by Ogden Nash. <clears throat> Go hang yourself, you old MD. You shall not sneer at me. Pick up your hat and stethoscope. Go wash your mouth with laundry soap. I contemplated joy exquisite. I'm not paying you for your visit. I did not call you to be told my malady is a common cold. By pounding brow and swollen lip, by fever's hot and scaly grip, by those two red redundant eyes that weep like woeful April skies, by racking snuffle, snort and sniff, by handkerchief after handkerchief, this cold you wave away as naught is the damnedest cold man ever caught. Give ear, you scientific fossil. Here is the genuine cold colossal, the cold of which researchers dream, the perfect cold, the cold supreme. This honored system humbly holds the super cold to end all colds, the cold crusading for democracy, the Führer of the streptococracy. Bacilli swarm within my portals, such as were ne'er conceived by mortals, but bred by scientists wise and hoary in some Olympic laboratory. Bacteria as large as mice, with feet of fire and heads of ice, who never interrupt for slumber their stamping elephantine rumba. A common cold gadzooks, forsooth. Ah, uh, yes, and Lincoln was jostled by Booth. Don Juan was a budding gallant, and Shakespeare's plays show signs of talent. The Arctic winter is fairly coolish, and your diagnosis is fairly foolish. Oh, what a derision history holds for the man who belittled the cold of colds. <clears throat>